Hey there, welcome back to the channel. This is our setup, what we've been using. Got a couple totes in the back with some things in it. Crate in the middle that I've sometimes thrown some firewood in. And the tote in the front with some tools, some recovery gear, just setting odds and ends. Spare tire, folding table, shop cat. But uh, on the uh, four, M416 group in Facebook, um, there was a gentleman in there that uh, did not get attacked by a cat, but he found some other storage totes that four of them fit in here pretty good with a little bit of room in the front for whatever, whether it's a spare tire or a table or whatever. So got online, um, found these totes and ordered them through eBay. We had found them on um, Home, Depot, Home Depot for about 145, 150 bucks. Lowe's was a little higher. Amazon was ridiculous, like $300. And I found a place on eBay that wanted like 62 bucks. You can buy them in a set of, or a, you can buy them individually, or you can buy them in a set of four. And it was 62 bucks for the whole set of four, which I didn't think was quite right. And sometimes eBay and those online places can be sketchy. So I sent a message to the seller right away, messaged me back, confirmed it's the set of four. So I let him know you'll see my order shortly. I ordered them up, got them. So now I'm going to start switching some things out and I'll show you how we'll see. I saw one picture online. It looked pretty good. So I'll let you know and show you how well they fit once I get the gear changed out. So I got the uh, new tubs in and now that I've got them in there, I'm not blaming the guy who bought them and took the picture that I uh, got the idea from, but his picture was kind of low angled and the tubs looked like they filled the bed a little more than they do, which is fine. They're just not quite as wide and as, as they don't fit as tight. So there's going to be room for, for sliding around. So you see there's, he, he did say that there was room in front of him. He actually shows a couple of uh, 20 pound propane tanks. I just didn't realize how narrow they were. So I've got room for more gear, which is great. Um, like I said, I'm not, I'm not, no beef with him. He, he showed a good picture. It was a little low angle, so it was a little deceiving to me, but I'm still glad I went with them because you can see my my stuff laying out there. I emptied everything. There's a couple little odds and ends I never used, so I decided to leave them out. Um, but they're not anything that took up any space. A couple of dry bags. Um, so, as you can see, I've got a lot of room. And everything I took out of those, and a couple more back here, everything out of all of those tubs fit in these four tubs. So there's a lot of room in them. They're a little, they're narrower, but they're longer and taller. So, I'm glad I got them. They are, they do hold a lot more. I was able to get everything in there. And honestly, we've got a lot more room. Um, they're on there pretty good. This one's completely empty. So we've got a lot more room. I can't remember what we put in that other one. Well, well, I don't know what we're gonna put in there off the top of my head. Um, so we've got uh, like our bathroom and bug stuff all in there. Got a portable toilet, everything we need in there the shower tent that we can use a portable toilet with. That one's got all like recovery gear, a little bit of tools, um, not much of that in there, mostly recovery gear, um, fire tools, a small shovel, a hatchet, my fire poker, um, I think there's a poncho, rain poncho in there. And then that one is kitchen stuff. So a couple small stoves, uh, or a small stove and the Coleman oven, um, her utensil kit. There's still room in that one as well. So pretty happy with it. There's a lot of room. Still got a whole empty container, a lot of room around them. So I'll get my spare tire back up in here for now. Um, later on, I think I'm gonna mount that on the outside and get a tarp. I don't want the spare tire on the inside because then I have to stretch the tarp up over it. So 
that'll come before our big trip this summer but uh starting to get everything narrowed down um we're fine for weekends but we got a two-week trip we're planning this summer that i just want to get everything dialed in for the bigger trip so that's what all of this is working toward so right now i'm gonna um put the put that stuff away but just wanted to show you the difference here and um I'm gonna wrap this one up. So remember, we adventured our level, get out there and adventure your level. Oh, one last thing. I don't know if you can hear it in the background, but I did a short video talking about, you teach your wife to use a zero turn, you get more time with your Jeep stuff. Can't hardly keep her off that thing now, so good times. How you doing, buddy? Look, good boy. Look, good boy.